So alrighty, here's my uh, super fortress. Uh, it it's literally exactly what I decided to call it, super fortress. I don't care if uh, a thousand synths attack this place, they're going to die. I don't care if the Brotherhood tries to reclaim my suits, they're going to die. And I'm going to show you why. Even though I use some of the Brotherhood uh, stuff, I put a little mod in here. I kind of like the Brotherhood. Oops, I don't want to do that. So I put these beds down here. Um, just in case uh, we get attacked by raiders. When I sound the alarm, the settlers could come here for safety. This is my apartment. As you can see... I got an entire comic book collection. That was fun. I got TV that doesn't do anything really. Mama Murphy's chair. She's got her old ass up here if she wants to use it. My bobblehead collection. Now, that was also fun. Nuka Cola machine. Uh, actually, we'll take a look uh, in here. This is my bedroom where I take a nap. A little cabinet here, some paintings, my dining room table, my bar, ashtray, garbage can, some cabinets, cooler, and a radio. I can have a cooking stove here. A jukebox, cigarette machine. I have a uh, ice machine, of course, and a bathroom. Say, so if I want to take a dump, I need some privacy. Boom! Close the gate. Everyone, leave me alone, you know, taking the dump. Boom. All right, now let's go up to the uh, bread and butter. I just expanded this third level here. My guy is stuck for some reason. All right. I expanded the third level. And we're going to go from this side. I'll show you those in a sec. I got a terminal that uh, I have every turret connected to. I can tell the spotlights to only shine on me or enemies or whatever so I got workstations well not the workstation but you know armor ones and cooking and whole works now I killed Duke of the Atom Cats and took his armor and then I realized oh I could have uh, done missions for those guys and did this paint job myself this is one of my first sets of armor, I believe. I did some cool little paint job. Uh, T-45, I got some T-51 on it. Yeah, it's, a, it's a mix. I found this one here. I found that in uh, top of a building somewhere. I would fight some robots and stuff. Uh, that's an X-01. Then, uh, you know, of course, I got fusion cores in each one of them. This is a uh, mutt. Got a whole bunch of ones here. All right, we'll keep going down the line. Winterized uh, T45, T51. It's okay. All right. Now, I'm a Brotherhood guy, right? I killed two, but I killed two knights. Took their, their stuff because they were, you know, d bags. So I had to kill them. They, uh, you know, you, you, I was talking to him. He says, he says something rude, and I was it. This is the one the Brotherhood gave me. I put a chat pack on it. Look at that sexy beast. And then I bought this one. Or... Oh, I took one from a dead uh, knight that I was helping. But I, I didn't do a good job. And I, I couldn't just leave the armor there. And then uh, I bought this one from uh, Proctor Teagan. Um, I have I I built I expanded this since the last video because I'm gonna add a, I have a lot of pieces um, I got another X01 and I made it look cool now here's the real butter right here the new X02 you wouldn't believe this but I did the mission this enclave mission and I managed to get my hands on seven of the these X02s while fighting I have a perk where I could fast travel, even being heavy, um, having too much stuff in my bags. So I, uh, I gave this thing, like, you know, coils and all this stuff. That way I can use the uh, Tesla Cannon, and it's way more effective when you have that equipped. 
Now here's here it is when you don't do anything. It's just straight up. Sweet. See how Mark three? These are Mark threes. I didn't do any mods or didn't cheat to get these. I got these straight up. I'm very hard. Mark fours. I did a little extra here. I think I gave this one uh one of them, oh yeah, that one's got the jetpack, this one doesn't. And this is a uh, Hellfire MK. Uh, I managed to get my hands. This this guy was a beast. I had one early in the game. Well, for me, a couple weeks ago. I was being, uh, I was just, you know, exploring the world, and all of a sudden, these people start chasing me, and I look back, and this freaking thing with a giant incendiary, uh, a big giant flamethrower shooting stuff at me. I'm running for my life. I happened to just barely kill all of them, and I took that. But I got more during that mission. So I ended up bringing back two more of these. Two more. And then I got this one I found. Is it this one? No, I don't know. One of them I found on the ground. Uh, just going, trying to trace my footsteps back to that area just in case I can, you know, catch one in an XO2. I happened to find a guy just laying there. Took all of his gear, all of his armor. And uh, there's a Brotherhood version. I managed to, I can make a Brotherhood version. Which is kind of cool. So you can literally fight as the Brotherhood. And here's a, just a T-45. You can tell it's all rusted out. Nasty, nasty. Then we got a, uh, a Raider armor. And a Raider 2 armor with Tessa's fist. It's a legendary weapon. Uh, you can just punch the hell out of people. Um, so yeah. Got a lot more room here. I'm going to show you I have a safe. Uh, I got a lot of, you know. T uh, 60s. <clears throat> T 51, T 45. <clears throat> More uh, Raider power armor. Stuff I've collected. T 45 stuff, T 51. And nothing, nothing big. So I, if I, I, I might make some to uh, leave out there for the uh, settlers. Alright, here we go. Now we're going up to the power room. <clears throat> it's more space here. I'll probably throw some smaller generators. Got some spotlights and stuff. That one's down, actually. I don't know why. Maybe I have too much going on here. That's a laser. Let's see if we'll fix it while we're standing here. Hmm. I can just do this. I don't like leaving my stuff. You know, I'll worry about this crap later. Alright, then we got, you can see it's all just beastly in here. Nothing, nothing pretty. Just does the trick. Now here we go to the top. Artillery. Two our pieces. Spotlights and uh, laser, uh, missile cannons, laser cannons. Um, spot for me to actually observe. You can see down there I got a whole bunch of uh, uh, water purification plants and uh, generators. My whole idea was to make my water way higher than my defense so I get rated. I, want, I love getting rated. Alright, now, that's my uh, fortress. See, I got... I gave some of these dudes some good weaponry. Try to at least. Another day of hard work. So I made this place look kind of decent. And look, yeah. Trash Can Carla stole one of our uniforms. So Lost during the the last uh, raid against the, uh, the Sins showed up. Where the hell did you get that? My old man taught me that duct tape could fix anything. What the hell is that gun? Come here, Sturgis. Just wanted to trade a few things. 
He took my cryolator. I, I put the cryolator in here. He just took that shit. So yeah, uh, we got this going on. I put some power to everything. These two, my settlers, look, this Marcy. They're ready to kill. I'm not even, they're not even playing around. Uh, my farm, I just extended it. I gotta get more settlers. I suck at getting settlers. But I just extended it. Watch my back. I'll watch yours. I got dance here. But yeah, there was, that was my old house. I'll just check it out while I'm here. It's where I used to keep my power armors. That was the one thing I had in here, and I, and I just stood them up. This is my old save. I still have stuff in here. I probably got some, uh... I don't know. I don't really have much. Cryo mine, crippling laser. Yeah. Nothing special. Uh, yeah, nothing good in here. But, uh, yeah. That was my fortress up there, and I hope you guys enjoyed Maybe I'll get you guys inspired to build something stupid and crazy like that. Um, well, have you guys had a good time? See you next time. Oh, subscribe if you can.